basically I'm going to be showing you Alexander McQueen sneakers dupes. Basically what happened was I was at Primark the other day with my friend Issy. Uh, she visited me from Sussex because we were both doing the graduate, you know, adult in life. Uh, and um, I was at the shoe section and I was like, "Raw, right, they look like my Alexander McQueen sneakers. And I was like, Wow, Primark really be copying to the T. They always be doing that though, let's be honest. They always copy like designer products, designer shoes, bags, whatever, clothes, whatever's on the high end, they're gonna copy on the high street. So I'm gonna show you my Alexander McQueen sneakers. These are them, they cost me 360 pounds. I have worked hard for them, so. That's that. I got the blue suede ones at the back with the new Alexander McQueen logo. These were 360 from Selfridges here in Manchester. And um, they served me well. I really like them. I really try to take care of them as much as I can. You know, obviously it's an investment in everything I've got. It's not something I take lightly when I buy these things. I absolutely um, work hard for them. And I deserve it. So I had gone back to Primark in Manchester today and bought myself the dupe. So these are the Primark um, equivalent to the Alexander McQueen trainers. I was just like, yo, this looks <laughs> like my shoes, but the ones with the black. So the Alexander McQueens, they actually do have the ones with the black back as well. And if you go to the women's section, then you've got the white with the black back. On the men's section, they have got the white ones, they're a little bit more of this color rather than a pure white. And I feel like the texture is a little bit different. This one's a little bit closer to the actual Alexander McQueen's. And they've also got a black and white pair. How bloody much of a copy is that? They are a thick hill, which is the main like point, I think, of the Alexander McQueen trainers. They also have the colored backs. The differences are the Alexander McQueen ones, they go all the way to the side. They've got holes on the sides as well. These ones don't. The lip of the shoe is also different. So basically with the Alexander McQueen ones, these are steel. So these will never bend. These, it's just, you know, a soft leather. Also, this one's very light and airy. The Alexander McQueen ones are meant to be oversized and heavy. But the overall look is the same. Wouldn't you agree? Do you agree? Tell me down below. Am I tripping? Am I tripping? Let me know. And the biggest and the most positive difference is the fact of the price. 360 and 12 pounds. That's a whole lot of difference. Let's try these on. To tell you overall, I know a lot of people, I see a lot of people with Alexander McQueen trainers with this color, actually. Um, a lot of guys wear this on a night out to Ark, live, impossible, here out in Manchester. A lot of girls wear it too, just to go out shopping. I know girls have gone out with the Alexander McQueens in festivals. I'm not that type of person, to be honest. I paid way too much money for this. So I like to, you know, Take it out on a sunny day or a special occasion, you know, not when it's raining, when it's muddy, on a nightclub, on dirty floors. It's not really my gig. No, absolutely not. I like to take care of my stuff, especially when I paid a lot of money for them. So I think these are a really good alternative to have that sort of chic, you know, high end look without having to pay that price and also having to ruin your Alexander McQueen's. I'm also that boy that don't give a shit if like I'll be wearing this or this. Like it's fine, it's absolutely fine. Like I'm wearing Boohoo right now and I'll still wear my Alexander McQueen's with it. And I'll wear my Gucci belt and I'll still be wearing Primark jeans with it. I honestly don't care. Like if it looks good, it looks good. But yeah guys, I just wanted to share with you guys, these Alexander McQueen dupes. If you've got the Alexander McQueens, let me know down below. If you get the Primark ones, let 
me know. Uh, comment, like, subscribe, all of that. And I love you, all five of you. 